Hi there, Bill Oxnine here, and today we've got a special guest and surfer extraordinaire, Mike Norquist. Hey there, guys. Today we're going to take the mini dom and run through the different props. 30 millimeter, 32 millimeter, 33, and 34. And we're going to use what we got today is our radar gun. Getting some readings out there today, guys. Yeah, but uh, we can't do it here. What if, how are we going to get there? We better teleport. On the count of three. One, two, three. Shazam! Whoa! Oh. All right. Here we are at the lake, man. Made it. One piece. That teleporter works really well. Time to let her rip. Only well, showing 18. Yeah, I can't be right. Does it need to be coming straight at me? That's how you do it. I got 39 as the highest on that one. Took a couple passes to figure out the thing's gotta be coming straight at you to get a good read on it. I'm not quite sure how accurate this gun is. I'll probably get a different one, but we're having a good time with this one as it is, so we'll take it from there. Forty. Yeah. Sure is nice to be able to take a break at the lodge and have a brewski right in between and running such a fast boat. Sure is. Yeah. yeah, man. Know we got here today. Good old Mike has never driven an RC boat before in his life. He's giving it his first shot with the mini dom. Self-riding is here.
know, Mike, you're pretty good at this, man. I think next video will be me and racing each other on these things. This is my dad. <laughs> That's the attitude. <laughs> Well, it looks like we had a great time running boats. Looks like you had a great time running for your first time. I couldn't believe how fast that thing was, man. My fingers are still hot. <laughs> we got some good reads with the radar gun too, didn't we? Yes, we did. And the results are gonna be in the, in the end of the day. Well, heck, we didn't drive here. How are we gonna get back? We might as well teleport. Out the count of three. One, two, three. Shazam! Whoa! <laughs> What a man, trip. That was crazy, man. That was a lot of fun out there, huh? It was a lot of fun out there. We're back here in one piece. <laughs> That's important if you want to play with them anymore. Well, there you have it, folks. We did some testing with different props on the Mini Dom, bone stock, to see what we got. It didn't seem like it climbed much past 40 miles an hour with different props, but remember, again, we did a zero tuning. I just wanted to let you guys see what a person gets opening the box using our batteries, our props, and our boat. More to come soon. We're going to do some more tuning, and we're going to get the boat dialed in to extract more speed out of the bigger props, and that's going to be one of our next segments. I know a lot of you have been out there and tried to get into RC boating and went on Facebook groups and got totally discouraged and been on Facebook groups where you asked questions and you felt dumb. You felt like you were asking a stupid question. Then some bully comes on there, and Mr. Guru, I know everything and makes you feel dumb and we've abolished all that. We've got a hot up and coming group called Passion for RC Boats. There's no negativity going on there. There's nobody bashing other boaters, other companies, other brands. It's just all positivity. It's a really awesome thing. And I'd love for you to be part of it because we're the new generation of RC boaters. No longer is it people that hide secrets and pirates and I'm the best. No, it's all about a big racer mentality. We're just trying to get out there and have some fun and bring families together and get people outdoors. So come check us out. Remember, it's Passion for RC Boats on Facebook.